We're used to leaders that designate roles and, and take complete control and just having us be subject to their will, whatever they feel, is, is the right thing to do. That's why it's so hard for a lot of people to understand that literally this was organized by just a call. A call for an action. And people self-organized with no leaders. They just came together and decided we should work together to do this action. People also should really feel empowered to take this step and to be faces of this group. Because while it is easy to have one face or something, that's not what this group is behind. This is the people's medical. And almost everything that is here has been completely donated by people off the streets. A lot of people coming in, bringing donations, like piece of water, napkin, and that's been very amazing. One of our central media center, where we try to get all the uh, Twitter updates, all the Facebook updates, anything we can to, to get the message out, because obviously mainstream media is, is slow to react and not necessarily giving things a positive spin. We have uh, direct actions, which are marches. They happen symbolically uh, during the opening bell, in the morning of the New York Stock Exchange and in the afternoon of the closing bell. They're a lot of fun. They help rally people and, and raise spirits. I'm not interested in pandering to any binaries of politics. This is not political, this is human. This is like real, real human issues about survival and about creating a thriving world, which we have not seen and that we've been denied. I think a lot of other people are here um, for other similar concerns like myself, that they see our countries being destroyed and that this, there's an unaccountable elite that they can voice their, their frustrations to and let's say other people are here because they've been hurt, like we've all been so badly hurt. It's amazing to see these people, I mean like these guys are just doing something like right now, like I have no freaking idea what they're doing but it's definitely creative. And it's definitely going to open up like the minds and the hearts of people. Um, and you know, you don't see that every day, but here we've created the opportunity to do so through t occupying this space. So it starts small in this, and this is, I mean, it's riveting. It's just, you know, you know how right this is when you're here. The organic nature of it is open and welcoming to people who want to not just come in and stroll around, but who actually want to yeah. take now on I'm actually responsibility. Last Thursday we brought a Serbian revolutionary here named Ivan Marovic who uh, helped to overthrow Milosevic to create a youth movement that overthrew Milosevic and then he went on to counsel revolutionaries around the world and he came and looked at this and gave some advice. The main thing was to brainstorm funny actions in public so it'll communicate you know what this is about to more people because journalists will like it, people in the street will like it, it'll just be a, a yeah and, and kids will want to join because it's the cool place to be. I agree with that it needs to be a sort of positive narrative that develops a, thing, uh, a story that gets out there that isn't about getting arrested because most people don't want to come down here and get arrested so they're staying away because they're worried they'll get arrested, which really isn't the case. You can come here and not get arrested pretty easily. President Obama! President Obama! Spoke before the Congressional Black Caucus! Spoke before the Congressional Black Caucus! And told them! And told them! To get themselves! To get themselves! And their people! And their people! The hell into the streets marching! The hell into the streets marching! We have been having... We have been having... People! People! From Wall Street! From Wall Street! Bring down the capitalist system. I'm talking about pure democracy in the workforce and in every in every aspect of our lives. Co-ops, work communities where people are sharing in the profit. We work for a company. Say someone owns a company. We all share in that profit.